we face just one more challenge before launching. The trigger won't stay up. At one time, we would just put a couple of strips of duct tape on the inside of the pipe so there was enough friction to keep it up. But now we have a better way. We'll make a spring from the part of the two liter bottle where the label is. It's easiest to start the cut with a razor blade and switch over to scissors once you've gotten through. Save the bottom. You can use it to launch water balloons. With the ends off, take off the label. Gently flatten the cylinder and put the pipe in the middle. Trace a circle on the inside of the pipe. Flip over and trace another circle exactly lined up with the first circle just on the other side. Cut out the circles and do not cut outside the line. Holding the ties tight temporarily with a rubber band or a piece of tape may help you with the next step. Put the spring on. The hose clamp will stop it from going further down the pipe. Then put the trigger pipe on, as shown, and thread the twine through the two holes of the spring. Get everything past the tie heads. Get the rubber band off and lock a bottle on. Tape the twine on near the bottom of that four foot pipe. With the bottle locked on, tape the twine just tight enough that it's not sagging. It is possible for the spring to slip past the hose clamp. So line up that leftover 22 inch piece of pipe with the hose clamp and tape it to the other pipe in at least three places. By the way, this will also add some stiffness to the other pipe.